This week on Fly Day, we tie in a great point fly for the washing line, the traffic light cormorant booby. Right, so the hook we got in, uh, in the vise is um, as a sprout wet, size 10. You're going to catch on your thread a couple of mil from the eye, saving a little bit of bulk at the end. Come halfway down. So last up is always tied on first. So last up is going to be the Opal Mirage. So we'll tie that on first. Catch it in. Catch it in. Come down to about just before the bend. On the way back up then, we'll catch in the red holographic. Uh, there and then rib the body catch off trim then take it open mirage and wrap on touching turns that point there, catch off. Trim. So now you're going to prepare a silver badger hackle. Take all the fluff from the bottom, tie it on the side with the good side facing you. Catch it in, break it off, get okay, hacker players, you went on a couple of turns, so that's three turns there, catch off, Put everything back. Off. I'm going to make it a smooth area here for your eyes. Come to the centre of that part there. Right, so at this point now, get your marble. Select a nice little bunch for your wing. All I do is I tie it on hole. And then trim it back. So from that point there, I'm going to cut straight, pull all the fluff out, and then hold it on top of the shank. A couple of turns, and then catch it in. Make it a smooth area for your eyes. At this point there, then you want to just come past the hook shank, the bend of the hook. Sorry, put your wing off. Now when this fish is in the water, I mean the with the opal mirage being over the red holographic, the red holographic will actually shine through the body. So you know, like a two-tone body effect. Um, gives a nice effect. So next you want to get your eyes. Tie them in the middle. What I do is make one loose wrap and the eyes are not square. If you pull down and bite into it, then that gap, that 
crease will stay there and make it difficult to tie the eyes on. So I'll make two loose wraps, twist the eyes straight onto the shank, and then what I do is wet my fingers, put all the marble and the hackles out of the way, and then figure of eight your eyes onto the shank. So whatever we're not being straight to this point, we'll sort that out in a second. Right. Now this point here, what I do is I come over the top of the shank, underneath the eye, the, the foam eye, over the top of the eye of the hook, under the foam, over the top. And if you pull, that tightens the eyes to the shank. And one last figure of eight. And then you pull back the eyes. Couple of turns in front of the eyes, and then whip finish. Trim. Now at this point now, you can have a look at your eyes to see if they're straight and you can twist them and get them into shape, whatever. And then what you want to do is screw the eyes, pull down the eyes, do it I guess. Put a drop of blo uh, blob, a drop of varnish, super glue in on the thread, and then underneath there. Now you have the traffic light common booby. Another quick and easy pattern there from Matt Pate that you can try this weekend. And there are plenty more patterns on our website, hmflyfishing.co.uk. A big thank you to you guys for watching, and please don't forget to subscribe, and catch you later. Oh, you can see my pocket. Traffic light. <laughs>